Hey everybody, this is Justin Buse, and I'm here to show you how to use the Dust and Debris Particle Pack. I actually would say this has to be one of my favorite packs because it's so simple to use. Um, for starts, what I'm doing here in the video is selecting some of the colors and then moving my value scale over to the gray side of the color wheel. This means that it's the same value as the color that I'm selecting from, but it's gray just like dust would be. Now you can play with the lighting of this depending on what you know about light, and I do recommend studying on light when you do edit these photos. But uh, I will say that selecting colors, like for example, if I were to select the background far out there in the sky, uh, which I did, you probably didn't see it, missed a frame, I think. Um, then it kind of used it to push the push the car back. It almost looks like it's further back now because I put some dust back there. Uh, I selected a brighter color. Um, so, so you're, what you're what you're doing is is you're selecting colors and and pulling those out, and it gives things a little more depth and expression. Because sometimes when we take a picture, it's of a still object. Um, your subject is still, and you want it to have expression, but you don't necessarily want it to have a spiritual vibe or something mystical. You just want it to be down to earth, like this car, literally. Um, so that's why I really like this pack is because if I take a picture of something, if it's a projector, a car, something that's a little mechanical, but I want to add some expression to it, a little fog, but not quite fog, uh, you can go ahead and add that. And it has, has great expression, some texture to it. Um, on a high res photo, uh, which this is, I can zoom in and there's little particles and it matches it matches my resolution I, I love that about these particles um, but that's pretty much what you're going to want to do with these is select and even if you were to use the glow part which i'm doing here up there on the color wheel uh, you'd go around and color pick still and you get this magical uh, result um, down to earth i should say but uh, still something that i'm sure you want thanks for watching and i'll see you around